Hello everyone. Welcome back to our YouTube channel Code is Our Kit. This is Nisarga and in today's video I am going to talk about one of the important concept in Python that is polymorphism. As we know that in Python there are four main pillars in OOP's concept that is inheritance, encapsulation, abstraction and polymorphism. So today I am going to explain you guys about polymorphism. So what exactly polymorphism says? This polymorphism sounds weird right? So let me split polymorphism as poly and morphism. Poly means many and morphism means forms. One thing can take many forms. So let me explain this concept by taking real life example. So let us consider human beings. We human beings behave according to the situations, right? So the way uh, we human beings and individual behave in different ways. The way we behave with our colleagues in the office is completely different from the way we behave with our best friends, right? An individual behave in different ways. So in programming language also that means in python also we use the concept of polymorphism while creating class method why because here python allows different classes with the same name method the method name will be same but the classes will be different so let me explain you guys with simple program okay this is the program for polymorphism so here here I have taken two different classes, class India and class South Korea. But method names are same, different classes but the same name method. See here, capital language renowned and here also capital method name is language and here method name is renowned. So let me explain this program. So class India, here I have taken the class name as India and the method name as capital and inside the parenthesis self is the first parameter and print statement says that New Delhi is the capital of India. This is one method name and the next method name is language and here print method says Hindi is the most widely spoken language of India and the next method is renowned and India is famous for largest democracy in the world. So these are the method names which comes under class India. So next class South Korea, same method, capital, language and renowned. Here the print statement says Seoul is the capital of South Korea and people speak Korean language. And obviously we know that South Korea is famous for its K-pop culture like BTS. And after this, we have to create a object obj underscore ind this is object and this is the class name and obj underscore korea is equal to south korea this is a class name and here i have used for loop for country in country here country is a loop variable and in is a membership operator and inside this parenthesis here i have created object object india and object this is Korea. So by dot operator I have created capital language and renowned. This is the method names capital language renowned country dot capital country dot language and country dot renowned. So if I run this program in the console you can see your New Delhi is the capital of India and Hindi is the most widely spoken language and India is famous for largest democracy in the world. So these three methods belongs to class India and here Seoul is the capital of South Korea. People speak Korean language and South Korea is famous for its K-pop culture and music like BTS. So this is this belongs to class South Korea. So this is all about polymorphism guys stay tuned for the next video and don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel and press the bell icon for future updates so that you won't miss 
any notification regarding our YouTube videos. Thank you.